So I think one of the hardest things to explain to clients is time. So I think time for a client means I want an answer today or I want an answer tomorrow. Unfortunately, it's not like 48 Hours or Criminal Minds or one of your favorite law shows. This could be a while until we know exactly what's going to happen. But the longer the case goes on sometimes, the better outcomes we actually get. And kind of explaining it from the other side is I was formerly a prosecutor. Now when a case first comes in, it can sit on that desk for a little while and we might not have an answer and we could keep harassing the state attorney's office, give us an answer now and it might not come right away. After they actually get the case, they then have to investigate it. After they go through and investigate the case, they have to make what's called a filing decision. Now, but for major crimes in the state of Florida, these are done by paper information. Now, if it's a misdemeanor case, that could be 30 days, it could be 60 days before we even know if they're going forward on the charges. Now that means I wanna to talk to you right when it happens, while it's happening. And by doing that, I can then get ahead of the game and start getting a hold of the state attorney that's involved in your case so that we can at least get moving in the right direction. And that could potentially be dismissing it right on the front end. So that case could end really quickly and it could be a short outcome. Now on the other side, if there's a major felony case, that doesn't need a grand jury indictment, the state attorney's office has to meet with the police officers and the witnesses involved in the case. That again could take a month or two before that even happens. And that's before you even know if you're gonna have charges filed against you. Once you have charges filed against you, you're gonna have an arraignment date in another three weeks. You're not gonna go to that because you're gonna have an attorney there to represent you. And then maybe another month before you even have a first pretrial and you don't even have your discovery yet. That's copy your police report, videos. Now at that point, you need to sit down with your attorney and you need to really understand what's going on with your case. And you could already be four or five months from the date of when this actually occurred. Now as we pick apart the state's case, we're able to actually see your defense and see your side of the story and communicate that with the state attorney's office. Now that's really important because potentially then we can get your case dismissed, we can get your case reduced, or we can make the, de the determination that it's time to go to trial. And we're not scared to do that because we've taken the time at this point to really go through the facts and we already know the answer. We already know you're not guilty. We're gonna make sure we get that uh, in front of the jury, in front of the judge, and get the outcome that you want.